Welcome to the demonstration of smart aqua farming. Experiments were carried out to test the functionality of the input sensor in the system. We simulated several conditions for the water quality. pH, turbidity, and temperature were measured under different water quality conditions. To provide more detailed findings, the pH level Turbidity and temperature were monitored every second. The fish farmer will be issued an alert when the corresponding sensor data exceeds the threshold value. A transmission of measured data between microcontroller not MCU and Blink occurs in the following order. First, the innovation was tested against cold, warm, hot water, and room temperature water through the temperature sensor. In the slide, we employed 4 pH conditions to test the pH sensor performance. Tap water, drinking water, bleach, and soap water. Since the water pH can impact the health of fish, the appropriate pH range for fish survival rate is between 6.5 and 8.5. If the pH value is less than 6.5, the fish growth rate will slow down because the fish are under stress. When the pH is between 4 and 11, the fish may not be able to survive. The following are the results from the measurement collected from the pH sensor. In the slide, we use clear water and water dissolved with different proportion of the coffee solution to test the turbidity sensor. The result demonstrate that water consisting of coffee solution gives high values and clear water provides NTU equal to or less than 1. The ultrasonic sensor measured the distance between the system and the water level. The water level monitoring ensured that the fish pond had adequate water and prevented water from overflowing. The system was configured so that the minimum distance between the ultrasonic sensor and the water equals to 5 threshold value. The buzzer is activated to the high mode when the measured distance is equal to or less than 4, signaling that the water will overflow. The water level is normal if the distance is more than or equal to 5. There are three different virtual LED sets in the Blink app. The red LED signal that the water will overflow and the buzzer is switched to the high mode. Green represents a normal water level, while yellow denotes a water level in the middle range. 